does matter because it's intended to threaten an entire class of people. If one burns a cross on a lawn or a vandalized a cemetery, a, a synagogue, if one kills a gay man or lesbian woman or a transgender person, there is a message to the entire class of people that's intended to intimidate. So it is important and it does matter. But we do have to, but again, murder doesn't occur in a vacuum. We have to change the entire construction, social construction and culture of the society that we live in, remembering that we all live in a context of absolute economic inequality. And then there are different levels of social inequality within that economic paradigm. Which I know we can't entirely address in I think oh, no. the one minute that we have left, but I <laughs> want to give you an opportunity to let folks know how community members can uh, participate in the survey that you have going on now. You're collecting data through December? Yes, and we will collect it, frankly, until we have an adequate sampling. We would like a lot more representation from non-urban areas and a lot more representation from older people and from very young people. Um, and so the survey will continue, hopefully, and will close at the end of December. The study will be published in May or June. And I would like people to become very engaged in the Pennsylvania Civil Rights Initiative and now in thinking about how do we respond to the Pennsylvania governor who has given his imprimatur to bill what was called 115 that excludes state universities, state-funded universities and colleges from compliance with local civil rights laws around the issue of health care benefits. Uh, this is a very important issue and clearly we can't discuss it fully, but there's a lot that people can do around petitions. Rita, I need I'm to, so sorry. To, to cut you short. It's I'm so sorry. Call. We're going to give folks an opportunity uh, to reach Great. you by uh, your phone number and the website address Great. will be listed. Thank you so much, Rita, and it's thank you for watching Philly Live.